What is going on, party people? My name is Seeds, and we are leaving the country. That is right, we are out of here. We've had enough of the US end to prepare for what's to become of us. It's time to do a little bit of research, understand the layout and the scope of what we are about to take on. Now, as a house artist, as an artist, it's important to just know where we're gonna go one day. And for that, to be prepared for when we leave the country, today we will be guessing festivals from around the world. And not just any sort of guessing, we will be geo-guessing. That is right, that is right. Today, y'all, we are going to be geo-guessing music festivals from around the world. Y'all, let's dig in. We are dropped into a blacktop area. We have a tent over here. We have the red and white crane. Now the red and white crane, if I'm not mistaken, is a vital European attribute to their cranes. It's very, that is the crane game. Kind of an older crowd. That's what I think is going on. This has to be Europe because there's an older crowd. And I feel like only in Europe, the older crowd willing to just party hardy. Uh, we can actually move. Oh my Lord. We can go from stage to stage, y'all. This is actually so rad. So we have red stage. We have red stage. No smoking cigarettes. So we know that this is an anti-smoking establishment. Oh, resident advisor. So we know that resident advisor is one of the most prestigious music promoter communities. We can go to resident advisor right now. I wouldn't consider this cheating. I'm simply showing y'all what resident advisor is. So we know this is an electronic music festival now, right? I don't think this is Amsterdam. I feel like it's a more like industrial place. And I feel like Amsterdam is a little bit more of a city. I feel like this could be London because there's a lot of English. Uh, I feel like there's like not even a sign of like any other language. I think we're going to just slam the middle of the UK. Finland. All right. So we, we did pretty well for the first little guess. I think we did pretty well. We got the Europe part, right? Okay. So this was on the Bay of Helinski. Helsinki? I don't know how to stay. Right next to S. Poo. <laughs> One sec. If I could quickly ask you to subscribe to my channel, I would greatly appreciate it. Over 90% of you are not subscribed. If you like the content and want to stick around, I would greatly appreciate it. Okay, back to whatever I was doing. Up next, it is pink. It is rainy. It is pink and rainy. Wow, look at this. Blue Provia cocktails. This person's very happy. Kebab, pizza, W, Vietnamese snacks, waffles. So part of me is still feeling the Euro. So I feel like we could kind of be somewhere where it's not as hilly, but it is like gray and rainy. I'm going to go. I'm going to go right here. Why not? Once again, oh, it was the. All right. So we got it in Germany this time. It was literally the border of Germany and Belgium. That's crazy. So I'm still pretty proud of this answer because we, we've got the German part right. It's the Belgium that's, that's getting us. It's really the Belgium that's getting us. So let's hop into it. What do we got next? All we have to work with is a crowd of people. Bulls jersey. We have New Look Wireless. Now, I've never heard of New Look Wireless. What other indicators could be around here? I feel like I'm gonna stick with the European, the European answers. We have Supreme though. And this looks like an A's hat. This could be America. But I feel like this, I don't know, like this is like concrete architecture and that definitely doesn't look like American like building. I feel like we're still in Europe. I feel like it's safe to say we're mostly in Europe. I feel like these people look like Lando Norris. I feel like we're in, I feel like we're in the UK, if I had to guess. This stage is magnificent though, super rad. Also new look wireless, I have no idea what that is. So it's English and it's definitely not a US phone carrier. So I'm gonna go like mid, mid UK. That's pretty good, I like that. That was pretty good. Americans guessing countries correctly, wild. Uncle Fringe, I will say. We're not the best with geography, I will say, but I 
would like to go ahead and say that I'm, I would like to think I'm slightly above the average American. Yeah, honestly, you got me. But that's, we're here to learn. We're here to better ourselves. The point of this stream is to better ourselves and to understand the different music climates of the world. So that's, that's what I'm doing here. We're here to learn. We're here to, to develop. We're here to understand the countries that we will be traveling, touring, and playing, you know? So why not, why not get a little bit, why not get a little bit more knowledge in there? So we have arrived to our next location. This is, this is for sure America. I've seen Firefly around. I feel like this is probably Michigan. I've heard of Firefly Festival. I think it's in like this region. If you lose your friends, come dance with us. I'm there. I'm there. You already know, plur. We're out here plurring it up. Michigan is a good guess. Firefly Festival, I'm gonna say is by Grand Rapids, Michigan. Delaware. All right, we were pretty off. Pretty cool lineup. Oh, shit. Tsunami's on here and Kazmalia. Hell yeah. Uh, pretty cool lineup on that one. Ah, oh. all right. So this one I feel like is easy. This is Austin City Limits. Don't ask me how I know. Don't ask me how I know. Just a really good guess. I think it's safe to go smack dab right in the middle here, y'all. That is our best guess yet. It's a matter of time before we get a repeat, but y'all, I attended this festival for the first time this year. That kind of looked like my homie. I was like, wait a minute. Yeah, you already know, Goth Mystery Mafia. We have arrived at Coachella. We've arrived to Coachella in the Indio area at the Empire Polo Grounds Club. 5,000 points a ruse everyone we are so good at geo guessing festivals i'm so proud of everyone here all right we have arrived want to know something crazy this one is tough i think i've fucking been here i saw a mozart symphony here so this is austria this yeah this one is actually insane so when i went to europe the fact this is here i literally sat like there my brain is working so hard right now. It's crazy. Um, oh, it was the music rhyme. That's literally it. Y'all, okay. I'm pretty sure this is the music rhyme. Like, I'm not gonna lie. I like that name. Oh, y'all, here we go. If this is right, I will literally sh myself. Ready? In three, two, one. Let's go. 5,000 points, baby. Hell yeah. We love classical music here. The Music Rhine is an impeccable venue. That is absolutely insane. Y'all, we learned so much today. We learned that there is a lot of metal concerts in Belgium, Germany. We saw some fantastic concerts coming out of the UK, out of all over the world. There's a lot of cool places to concert it up. We saw Coachella. We saw ones we're familiar with. We saw Bonnaroo. We saw Firefly Festival. We saw many, many different festival locations. We even went into the depths of Finland to Helsinki to see a little bit of a concert. Then we transitioned it into just music venues, music cities, the Austrian city of Vienna, where we saw the music Vrine, and then we transitioned it into music cities where people were born. After this game of GeoGuessr, we have, we have opened, expanded our knowledge that much more. And I wanna thank y'all for being with me. My name is Seeds. Thank y'all for coming to this stream. I will see y'all later.